Leon Edwards, Kamaru Usman, Paolo Costa, and Luke Rockhold. My name is Dan Quinn, and I'm not just somebody sending a video to you guys. I was a would-be first-round draft pick in the NFL back in the 80s who gave up football for boxing because I would have had coaches killed and I'm a future billionaire and I'm going to create a new fight league to replace the UFC that will pay 90% of profit down to the fighters who earned it. What you should do is look at Dan Quinn's Notre Dame play, see me catch the tailback diving for a touchdown on fourth and inches. It's a spectacular play, a white Lawrence Taylor, and I get fired for it, so I immediately quit football for boxing, and it's a whole other story, but how much is the UFC not paying you guys? I saw an article that says the UFC keeps its pay to its fighters close to the vest, they don't want to tell anybody how little you guys are making because they're embarrassed. Only a few millionaires and Dana White's worth $500 million. He's a fat piece of shit that never fought a day in his life. He's the son of a capo or of one of the Fertitta brothers. And uh, he was thrown a bone and he's making hundreds of millions of dollars while you guys are fighting for pennies on the dollar. And what I'm going to do after winning a Nobel Prize, oh, what you should do is look at my video that I made with Diego Sanchez before he fought BJ Penn for a world title, where he says that Stevie is a miracle. It is. It's going to win me a Nobel Prize because I'm the guy that figured out what massive amounts of stevia does for the human body. It cures cancer, diabetes, and obesity, and it also splits water into a natural gas inside the blender. You can actually view it for yourselves. Put a half teaspoon to a teaspoon full of stevia in a blender full of water, close the lid, turn it on, and the top will probably blow off because water triples in size, turns into a white soup that a PhD in the past has told me is a natural gas that can run engines called split H2O. Yeah, and its exhaust can be turned into what acts like the fountain of youth if you remove all of the floating toxic soap at the end of the blend. You can also see all that soap floating in the video that I shot with Diego Sanchez. Anyways, that water laying underneath that layer of soap. I call it pure H2O. And pure H2O cured my uncle's six cancerous breast tumors in four months. Diana, can you not walk behind me, please? Anyhow, it cured my uncle's six cancerous breast tumors in four months. Knocked off 74 pounds of flabby fat in four months, and type 2 diabetes was gone within two weeks. But I have to be honest, I think the uh, type 2 diabetes would have been gone within two weeks, even without blending out all the toxins that are hidden in water, because stevia just does that. I have a text from Nick Faulkner in Vegas saying that stevia is a miracle that his dad does not have to take insulin shots anymore because of it. Anyways, I'm going to win a Nobel Prize. I'm going to replace the UFC with the pure fighting championships that pay 90% of profit down to the fighters and at millions of hits that will make millionaires left and right in the fighting ranks. It will be like the IFL is to the PGA. It'll pay to start a new league, and you guys could actually spearhead that. Try one of my miracles on your girlfriend, Luke Rocco. It's called the Fountain of Orgasm for Women. It's called the Violin. It's pressing down 
and up on the G spot at the same time in massaging in a violin action. Two fingers in and up to the bottom of the G spot. Two fingers pressing down below her belly button on the uh, right side to your left to her right on below her belly button, touching the fingers that are inside and massaging. Her pelvis will come out the bed to attack your face. It's the fountain of orgasm for women. It's taking a woman who was raped and couldn't come to over 100 orgasms in an hour. And it pales in comparison to how good stevia is for the human body and for saving this planet because stevia creating pure H2O. They can build engines to run off of pure H2O. They can send a rocket to Mars on one tank of gas there and back. I'm brilliant. I was a fighter, <laughs> which isn't brilliant, but um, who would you rather fight for? Somebody like Dana, who's taking all the money for himself and is a fucking gangster's kid and never had to fight a day in his life, or somebody like me who's actually been in a cage and is going to pay all the money down to those who deserve it.